Hey guys, Chris from Provo Beast Audio Installation, and today we're doing front door speakers on an E-Series Econoline Ford vehicle. Um, this is the RV version, but this would be pretty similar to the van version as well. We're going to show you how to replace the factory speaker by first removing the door panel, removing the speaker, wiring, reinstallation of the new speaker, the reassembly of the door. So let's go ahead and get this door panel off. Provo Beast Audio Installation Channel is sponsored by NVX and Sonic Electronics. Get 10% off all speakers, amplifiers, wiring kits, and more with coupon code PBAI at NVX. Also get 5% off all car audio components at Sonic Electronics with coupon code Provo Beast. Now I'm outside today, so it's a little bit louder. I do apologize. And I don't have my tripod today. We're out and about, so it'll be a little jumpy, so I apologize beforehand. Uh, using a panel tool, we've actually just kind of loosened up this panel. They're just clips. There's one here. Clip up front as well. That'll give you enough slack to disconnect those harnesses there. Now we can begin to see the speaker there. Now up underneath, you're going to see the little, uh, little cover over a screw. On this right-hand side, get a little flathead screwdriver. Pop that open and remove that screw there. Okay, so we remove that Phillips. Now this little panel has to also pop on off. Now it's just held on with clips. Okay, once that's off, we're gonna have a Phillips here as well. We're gonna have a little cover here, pop that out too. There's gonna be a Phillips inside. And this panel, again, just held on with clips all the way around, we'll pop on out, just like so. Giving the space to clear the door handle. And finally, once that's out of the way, you're going to notice there's going to be one more screw here. Go ahead and take that one out. At this point, they're actually not clips. They're little tabs that hold the door on. All I have to do is lift. Can give it a little shake. Just like so. Now here, you're going to either have a... Uh, generally a 7 millimeter. Go ahead and pull this out. This is a 6x8. Um, once we get that speaker out, disconnect the harness. All right, speaker's out. Here we are. Now we're gonna go with a set of NVX six by eight speakers, and we're gonna get these pulled out and uh, get them installed. There's the new speaker. It's a really nice V-series speakers. Handle quite a bit of power. Um, I'll throw a link in the description where you can find these. Um, also use our coupon code, you can save a little bit if you're going to order these from NVX. And our harness adapters, we're using the Metro 72-5600. What they do is they plug directly into the factory plug. They also seal, which is super nice. And then black is negative, white is positive. These hook up to your new speakers. We're going to use the same screws that we used to pull the speaker out to remount the speaker back in with the new harness attached and reassembly. All right, so I connected the harness up to the speaker um, and they popped right on and then I just put the speaker back in with the same screws, nice and solid. And I just have some talk radio going, everything works great. At this point, let's just reassemble the door panel. Okay, all reinstalled, that's about it. If you have any questions about this install, post a comment below. Thanks guys for watching and we'll see you in the next video.